What's up, fragrance family? It's Neeb with Aromatics, and we're back with another episode for the Dua Brand series, guys. Today's fragrance is called Choco Poseidon. Before we get into today's fragrance, please consider hitting that subscribe button, clicking on that notification bell. This is one of my top fragrances from the Dua Brand. It's rightfully so. It's Poseidon and chocolate, guys. Anybody that knows about the Duo brand, I'm sure you've picked up a Poseidon fragrance. Poseidon is their inspired expression of Creed Aventus. You have that pineapple, that black currant, the birch, all that good stuff. But this makes it a little bit more edible. It's sexier, for sure sexier. And I have some very good things to say about it. Let's see what's up. So. The opening, you will not mistake in the DNA, but there is a Montal chocolate greedy vibe in here. It's not just a chocolate, guys. Think of like that um, chocolate truffle, those desserts, and the, the little like, they look like Hershey Kisses, but they're, you know, chocolate truffles, whatever. Those things are powdered up with all that cacao powder. It's the cacao powder. If you've ever tried, cre uh, if you've ever gotten your nose on Montal's Chocolate Greedy, then you know that's one of the best, if not, in my opinion, it is the best chocolate fragrance. It's a realistic, literally photorealistic, chocolate powder, chocolate dust fragrance. So it's a cacao powder fragrance and it's perfect. And that's exactly the type of cacao I get here. So you have Creed Aventus and literally it's drowning in cocoa powder. So it, is phenomenal. It is a phenomenal blend, honestly. It's up there with some of my 10 out of 10 fragrances, if I'm being quite honest, guys. This is another 10 out of 10 fragrance, but I'm about to hit the brakes a little bit. Even though it's good, it's more than good, even though it's awesome, I don't know, it's softer than what I'm used to. So does it make it any less awesome? No. Does it perform? Performs fantastic. Takes Poseidon and puts chocolate on it. It's still fantastic. If you don't have the fragrance, I think you should definitely pick it up. So of the other Poseidons, this is one of the top five Poseidon blends, guys. Um, definitely one of the top. Poseidon's Desire 2, number one in my opinion. Then you have that Poseidon Vanilla Madagascar Chariot. Still, that's a number one part two. Like, I can't even give it a number two place. But this will fall into that number two or number three Poseidon hybrid. Even though you'd think that it's not much of a difference to the Poseidon, the chocolate, the Montal's Chocolate Greedy, I'm gonna just call it a hybrid of Montal Chocolate Greedy because that's exactly what I'm getting, okay? Um, it's very amplified, significantly enough to actually make this not a redundant purchase. If you don't already have Choco Poseidon, guys, I think it's usually in stock. You should definitely pick one up. It's one of the top three, maybe top five. Let's just put it at top five of Poseidon. Um, I don't get too much of that Creed Aventus sharpness with the pineapple and black currant, so it does away with that. It adds a gourmand aspect to it. This is an edible chocolate covered pineapple. The performance on it, it's a little softer on the projection. So that chocolate, although it makes it more gourmandy, it does soften out the projection and siage, but makes sense, man. You don't want to smell like a freaking, you know, cloud of chocolate. You do, but to the right person. These types of fragrances are pull me in, get closer, come and smell me. They're sensual, they're sexy. Definitely a uh, classification for this fragrance, sexy. Sexy, edible, um, seductive. Sexy, edible, seductive. That's exactly what this is. So chocolate, uh, cacao powder on top of a pineapple is what I get. If anything, I said you know, goes in line with the type of fragrances you're into, definitely pick it up. I picked it up. I don't regret it. One of my top Poseidon blends, period. Choco Poseidon, man, if you don't already have it, definitely consider picking it up. It's way under freaking rated for sure. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video half as much as I did making it for you guys. As always, love ya.